Hey guys, welcome back to part 50. Um, yeah, okay. So we're gonna go fight this bad man. right here. Okay, hold on. I'll go throw one of these first aid kits in there and I'll take that with me in case I do get poisoned. Does he poison you? Also, I like how the uh, music cuts out right there. I thought it started on fire right away. Jesus Christ. On the bright side, if I was in his hand, you probably wouldn't catch the edge. So there's that. Yeah, I don't like the... I don't think I'm going to bring the spark shot to fight him. It takes too long to do its thing. See, it tells me that it really packs a punch, but I don't, he didn't seem to give a shit that they pack a punch. <sighs> yeah, fuck it. I mean, maybe if I get it, like, right in his eye, it does, like, a ton of damage. 
Okay, so... I can just, um... I guess what I'll do is I will just, uh... I'll just, um... Like, I'll flashbang him. This is also a cool callback, uh, as well, to the original game. I don't think I talked about this first time. Originally, when you rode the tram car down to... When you rode, rode the tram car to the lab, or I guess not the lab, the tram car used to lead to the, uh... So he was in an animate. He okay. That's lame. So he was mid animation on that, and he uh, and it didn't take the flashbang effect, which is real lame. Excuse me, I am. Cool, thank you. Let's switch jukes, though. Like how he starts to get, he's like, he's tired. Basically, it looks like. You talking about all those corner man? Cool. Ow. That's fine. That's fine. I can take a hit. Oops.
don't I don't like that thing. But I think I'm just gonna I'm just gonna store it. And uh take that. I'll take that. Okay. I definitely have the fire bar to kill him this time. But Doesn't even fucking agree with me for like one second. It's just for like one thing. I just need him to work with me here. And he's like, no, I refuse. He's going through the animation of this doorway if I can just push by him. Holy fuck. Okay, well, I should use that right now. I can. Should have known you would die. Well, the more you know. That's what I get for overthinking things. Why do you have time to stand up? Oh my fucking god. This boss is gonna be the death of me. Jesus fucking Christ. Oh my god. I took so much damage on that first room. I mean, I feel like I just got fucking one popped in the fight. Oh my fucking god. What bullshit is this? What's going on here? Can't see me even just shaking my head. Click, click. Waste disposal, exactly where children belong. Waste disposal, Fortnite? Shit. Jerk. I guess it's technically not a timer, right? Now. I got my nails done. Should have known you would die. So it's interesting that in hardcore, they, they, like in normal mode, they make it harder by sticking a bunch of zombies in this hallway. Like, I find that really fascinating, you know?
jumpy attack. Terminate this. What's the reference to the original Terminator from the new book? We're too young to know what I was referencing. That was a fucking obnoxious fight. Jesus, that took me so much longer than it should have. I'm so sorry, Sherry. This is taking forever. I apologize to her. You're the one getting stabbed. I'm sorry, Sherry. I'm getting brutally mutilated up between here and there. So is the video player too. Like it stays highlighted for me, which makes me feel like it. They're supposed to be like a, a thing there. Sherry? Claire? Sherry, are you alright? <laughs> what are you doing? I'm here to help. I'm being a better mom than you. Sherry's been implanted. She can't be saved. Are you fucking kidding me? You're her mother. Get in here! You don't Oof. understand. William is still out there, and if I don't stop him... This conversation is over! Wait! Wait! I like how she has a wireless microphone. In my lab. It's not far away. Mommy? There's not enough time. Millions of lives are at stake. Sherry, mommy loves you, sweetie. Goodbye. Are you fucking kidding me? Sherry, don't worry. I will get you whatever you need, okay? Oh, why are you doing this? Because I care. Thank you, Claire. In this game, they don't explain why the pendant's important, do they? I think I said it before that in the original, her pendant had a dose of antivirus on it. Wait, that cable car. Yeah, I literally can't do anything. Wait, so is the zombie just. Gone. Is he relegated to a corner somewhere? They just despawn him. 
almost there, Sherry. Interesting. We're almost there. Good. Cable car. saying at the beginning of the episode the uh, on, Sherry, okay? originally when the cable okay, car went fine. from the sewer to uh, the there's another facility it was like a cable car okay. facility Better check everything there's no turn back oh fuck there's an ink room back there And all my viewers live together were like, fuck off. <laughs> Shit, there's something over there I could have missed. Hold up. My viewers collectively, hold the fuck up. This is the first few times. Oh, you can like get right up on here, eh? Where was one of those raccoon fucks around here? These short doors here. Uh, that's actually a bit of a reference to the original as well. I was going to put stab holes in the door for me. So you don't really get time to, like, I, I wish I had time to, like, stop and look over there as well to see where the hell he comes through. Because, like, he's stabbing me through the roof, which is weird, because how is it holding his weight? Um, I, I literally have no point for this right now. Um... But, like, at the same time... It's so weird. Like, it doesn't let me discard them either. But why? I mean... Well, no, because I guess they're used in other, other puzzles, right? Like... If you need the, like the king or queen key plug for it and stuff like that, and then you, if you need to lower the other the other gate, you need one of the plugs, so you can't just carry. I, that must be that's the only reason I can think of. It still bugs me. Okay, I'll we'll save once we get to the lab. I was I was expecting this episode to take. This tram is back like, get me to the lab a little bit. Do not exit until the final destination. Keep all arms and legs inside the ride at all times. Anyways, in this initial tram ride, when you're going to the, uh, to the original entrance of the lab, you, um, William, you fight to a William fight where he just, like, tries to stab his claw through the roof. Are you okay? Um, and the only way to fight him is you just shoot his hand when it comes through the roof. brother gave it to me. You know it's supposed to be lucky. I don't know what I'd do without you. Be dead. Are you kidding me? You were doing just fine without me until I came along and got you all sorts of trouble. I 
five something years. I don't want it. Really? Why not? It's so pretty. It's for my mom. For my birthday last year. All I really wanted was for her to be home more. I know it seems like your mom doesn't care, but... Uh, hey, uh, Sherry, come uh, here. Uh, hey, hang in there, okay? Now, arriving at the You. Come on. Uh. I'm getting you treatment. Just hold on, Sherry. It's okay. That's such a massive facility. Like in the original facility that they're here, in the original one, I, if I remember properly, there was a section you couldn't enter the facility, so you didn't get to see this full scope of it. But in Resident Evil Zero, you get to see the other part of it, and it's not very big. So I never truly understood why the lab had such a huge scope. Eat a dick. I never understood, like, why it's so big. Um. Like in this one, for example, in the original, you came across like a like a lab, like a crew quarters, basically. Now what? Um, and like, huh. you can't tell There's me. Be something here. Which in the original one made sense. Antiviral agent. That's it. That's gotta be it. Hmm. In the hey. original one. Hey oh, Sherry. French. I gotta go. You stay right here, though, okay? I'll be back soon. It's still your I bracelet. <laughs> it just never comes back. She played the long haul for that bracelet. She sold it for five bucks and got some cocaine. Um. Anyways, um, yeah. Because in the original one, it made sense. Because, like, this thing, this tramp still goes up to the sewers, right? Like, it's not exactly, uh... I'm not going to say glamorous. But, like... It's just one of those things where it's like... It, it, I couldn't see it happening like that. So, because like they have like a nap room, right? Which is like, I want to go take a lay down for a little bit. Which is great. But in the original one, you found like crew quarters. Like there was two rooms side by side, if I remember properly. And they each had like eight bunks in them or something like that. So, like, you'd walk in there, and of course they were just packed with zombies. Um, but at that point in the game, you were so loaded down with, like, grenade launcher ammo or shotgun shells and shit like that. They were trivial. But, like, it's weird, I guess, that that's how they chose to do that. Um, oh, it's just weird to me. It, it doesn't make, like, a ton of sense. But it works. Um, okay. Anyways, we'll see. It, it's just weird that, like, they would expect people to come in and out of here so much. Because, like, it made more sense when the facility was, like, self-contained. So it was like, yeah, we're down here. We live down here, basically. But now it's just, like, a family center. You know? Which is interesting and makes sense, because, like, you can't exactly expect people to keep completely quiet about their jobs. But, like, 
the visitor badge gets you into this door and then down that hallway, which leads to a cafeteria and a nap room. So, like... Oh, it's weird. It, it seems just kind of out of place. Anyways, uh, it's gone for quite a while because of all the animations and all my deaths. But thank you guys for watching. If you like saw, please do all the things, and I'll see you in the next episode.